So we're filming a quick little vlog today to show you guys our horse barn and the ponies and everything. Um, but we're just gonna go pick up some horse food first and go to Tim Hortons because we do that every day. Our neighbors across the street got a new Palomino and it's so pretty, but we don't know its name. So we just call it Pal. <laughs> Pal and Oscar. We're getting the horse food, but we have to put it in the back seat of my truck because I don't have a cover on it and it's kind of raining, so we don't want them to get wet. We just got two bags of beet pulp and two bags of step eight. And now we're going to Tim Hortons. I'm not supposed to have painted nails at work, but I'm gonna do it anyway. There you are, have a great day. Thank you. you We're gonna go feed the ponies lunch, but we make their grain up at the house because when they see you with a bucket, they get really excited and the grain has to soak for a little while before you can feed it to them. So it's a process, but then we'll take you down to see the ponies. Um, yeah, you can't see them from up at our house. They're like way over there in the bush. You can kind of see our arena, which is not yet an arena, but yeah, there's too many trees. I wish you could see the ponies from our house, but you can't. <laughs> Brienne has a baby slug on her hand. <laughs> That's so cute. Look at the eyeballs. It's cute. We're going to feed the ponies. How long will it take before they start yelling when they see us? Oh, I think they're both in their stalls. Oh. Hi, Bailey. <laughs> So this is Bailey. She's our neighbor's horse, but we are free leasing her for the time being. So we don't own her. We're just leasing her, but we're going to ride her and stuff. We've never ridden her before, but we are going to. She has a Western saddle, so we have to ride her Western. She's hungry for lunch. And she's, uh, she's 17 years old and she's a paint mare. And I think she's probably like 14 three maybe yeah, maybe 15 she, yeah she, just under 15 hands i think this is the front of the barn there's rumor he's hungry too so yeah this is rumor's side of the Paddock. There's like two separate ones. His is bigger than Bailey's, unfortunately, but that's just how it ended up. So, yeah, this is rumors. And then Bailey's is over there. And yeah, their stalls are just like a 12 by 12 size. Nothing fancy, but they're in our backyard, so we're happy about it. So, this is a farther away view of the barn. Our yard is still kind of a mess. We have some cleaning up to do still, but it's a work in progress. So um, up the hill from the barn, where we like walk down from, there's a bunch of grass, but we're gonna plant new grass in the fall and then fence in that area so the ponies can eat some grass over there. And then this is our huge shavings pile and we really don't like the shavings we figured out because the horses make like a huge mess of them and it's really hard to clean the stalls with them so we have to use those all up first unfortunately and then we'll probably get the pellets like we had before and then this is our attack room we're painting it white but we haven't finished yet because it's been like really hot lately um but yeah it will look good when it's all done and so this part of the shed is where we keep all our hay and we just got more delivered so it's like packed to the roof. Lots of food for the ponies. And then over here we are eventually turning this part into an arena but we are just going to let the horses eat the grass for the rest of the summer although it's kind of dead because it's been so hot. And we got all that white fence put in. If you guys remember from our house tour video a 
few or like almost a year ago we used to have like a brown wood fence but we got this white vinyl so the ponies can't escape and then this is our tack room and we're making this part into cross ties but there's still a bunch of junk there um, but we're gonna put rubber mats down and stuff and we'll show you inside the tack room it's not done yet but we've done like the major renovations so far we just have to hang everything up still and we're gonna paint the door black we think and then our dad's gonna put up a light on the outside because he's an electrician so that's handy <laughs> Um, yeah, so this is the tack room. We put new flooring in and then we did this wood paneling on the walls So it looks more like a tack room and we hung up the chandelier because every tack room needs a chandelier obviously um, And yeah, this is just a bunch of junk in here still, but there's just a sink there and Then there's a bathroom in here, which is kind of creepy But um, what's kind of lying on? It's just like a toilet a really creepy toilet and uh then my dad put a wood wall in here too, so it's kind of funny, but <laughs> there used to be like a hundred spiders in here and it took so long to get them all out, but it looks like there's none in here right now, so that's ideal. <laughs> um, so we're gonna hang these saddles on this wall, we think, on top of these shelves, and then we're gonna put our tack trunk on this wall and then hang saddle pads and stuff on this wall too. We got this cute little mirror thing that we're gonna hang on this wall and I'm, I'm not sure what we're gonna hang off of it maybe our helmets or something and then we got these wall brushes in the mail which are really pretty they're like a turquoise color and we're gonna make a video about them soon so yeah once we get everything organized and all finished we are going to make a whole tack room like renovation before and after video um, which we've been talking about for a long time, but we are going to do it very soon. So yeah, look out for that. Bailey's so cute. We still have to hang up a bunch of hooks and stuff to hold all their stuff, but we got these really cute horseshoe hooks that we put one on each side to hang up their halters on. And yeah, Brianne's gonna clean their stalls now. Maybe I'll go inside one of the dolls and show you a bit more so this is the view from inside rumors paddock that's the little barn and Bailey has this huge tree in her side but she doesn't seem to like try to eat it or anything so that's good rumor has this tiny skinny tree in his and I'm really surprised he hasn't knocked it down yet because he will rub his butt on anything the footing that we got in their paddocks is like crusher on the bottom and then they put sand on the top but it's like so deep in rumor's side we're gonna try to take some of it out we think because it's like really hard to walk on but rumor likes to roll around in it and stuff so he doesn't seem to mind but it's hard to push a wheelbarrow through too so we're gonna have to take a little bit out we think we haven't like pulled or cut rumors mane in a really long time so it's so long now but it looks kind of cute on him so i feel conflicted about cutting it but rumor show us your mane it's like really long he's like a western pony also real scraggly. this is the height difference between bailey and rumor i think bailey is actually shorter than 15 hands probably our legs are gonna like hang under her belly that's okay <laughs> So we just cleaned our stalls and now we're going to add some more shavings from our giant mountain. Rumors like the same color as the barn. We match the barn to our horse color. Yeah, sweetie. You want to help? <laughs> oh my god, that's not food. Why can't you be more like Bailey? Look at her. She's behaving. Um, no eating the barn, please. Wow, rumors so helpful. 
He's helping you get it out of the stall. So we're just gonna feed them their lunch hay now. Decisions, decisions. So is that the new hay? Um, yeah, there's like some local on top of that first cut, Timothy Bale. Or it was second cut. We had like a mixture of three different hays in here. <laughs> so they got a weird mixture for lunch yesterday. It's too much? No, that's okay. So that's pretty much it for our vlog today. Sorry it's a little bit short, but we're really not doing anything else exciting because Courtney has to work later tonight. But yes, this backpack we are also going to be doing a video on soon, so you can look out for that, as well as that brush video. And we are going to really try to upload once a week, like we used to, so we will try, but it's not a promise, but a try.